So I think I actually have landed on a girl baby name for once. I think I actually have a name I really like. Hey, finally. I've been waiting for this day. Go ahead. Lay it on me. Okay, but first, do you have any baby names that you like? Because I feel like the second that I say what I want, you're just going to agree and try to make me happy, which I don't want. Like, I want to know what's on your mind, too. No. I really have no names in mind for a girl, even though we're having a daughter. I guess it's because my whole life I wanted a daughter, but I, for whatever reason I always thought I was going to have a boy. And I always planned for a boy, so I only thought of boy names. I know that's silly. Really? What well, what's the boy name that you have in mind, if you don't mind me asking? The name I've always thought about for a boy since I was little, I don't know where I got it from, is Cody. Oh, that's funny because the girl name I like actually starts with a C. Do you want to take a guess? Um, C. I feel like there's not a lot of C. I know it's not Chelsea. <laughs> Sorry to make that joke. Um, I'm going to go with Claire. I thought about that name, but I really, really like the name Charlotte. I don't know. Is that stupid? Charlotte. Hmm. I really like that. I don't know why it makes me emotional. I like it. Yeah. I'm glad you like it. It would be Charlotte Montgomery. Wait. You gonna give her my last name? Charlotte Montgomery. You're the father, you know? And if she had my last name, that's my ex-husband's last name. I don't want her tied to him. You're the dad. She should have your last name. Damn. Thank you. Was expecting that. Appreciate it. What about Junior, though? Don't you want your daughter to be tied to Junior in that way? You know, when they go to school and all that? I've been thinking about that too, and I might change Junior's last name to mine. Um, but that's a, that's a whole different story for another day. Oh, I absolutely love the name. Oh, I hate that name. Wow, okay, Mom, tell me how you really feel. What's, what's wrong with that name? It's just, it's an old-timey name. You, know, you don't hear that name anymore, I feel. And I, I always liked the name Brooke for a girl. Okay, well, I'm sorry, but that's the name me and Brian settled on. I'm sorry you don't like it, but that's going to be the name of your new granddaughter. Call her C if you don't like it, I guess. Okay, I'm sorry. I shouldn't have, I shouldn't have reacted the way that I reacted. It's whatever. It's fine, really. Please don't be upset. It's a nice name. I, again, I shouldn't have reacted that way. I just needed time to think about it. Have you spoken to your sister after everything that happened? No, Mom. And I'm not going to. I guess I didn't have your ex-wife blocked on Instagram because she popped up and she's naming her baby Charlotte. <laughs> I wonder what, um... I wonder what last name she's gonna use. When you come up with these questions, like, and you say that I, I talk about my ex-wife too much, like, you just brought her up. I just told you, she popped up, and I'm just curious, you know? It's a big thing, what is she gonna give, what's the last name gonna be? Is it gonna be Riley or Montgomery? There's no reason to use my last name. She better not use my last name, because I'm never paying her a, a dime more than I pay her for child support now. You take this. So, um, remember the guy I used to work with at the bar? Hello? Man, I know I said I would keep the off the books thing between us, but a couple of guys walked into the bar the other day with badges and all that. And, you know, typically I would lie about this type of stuff, but they asked me if you work there. I couldn't lie because, you know, they, they checked the cameras. So I just told them, yeah, you work there and off the books. Yeah? Great.